Hi folks, I'm back on the, on the allotment, no aches and pains from yesterday and uh, guess what I've found, I've, I've, I, I bought some of this, um, oh I've had it a few weeks and I lost it, hormone rooting powder, I have been high and low looking for this, I've been through the shed at home, I've polytunnel, my office, I've been through these polytunnels, I've, I've been everywhere and I couldn't find it. So anyway, just before I came out, I went and ordered some more off Amazon, another couple of these. Anyway, what, what happens, I go in the big polytunnel there and there it is sitting on the, on the, um, on the pallets. How I missed it, I do not know, because I went high and low several times. But anyway, so what, what have we got to do today? Well folks, this is only going to be a little taster of things to come. What I've actually invested in, and these are, I've actually bought these off Amazon, but I've just placed an order with the manufacturer direct. And I've gone for some of these cutting globes. You've got different sizes, folks. Well, what we'll do is, let's just tell you a little bit about them first. It says new plants in as little as eight weeks. So what's it all about? Well, basically you you find a, uh, a shrub or tree, something what you want to get a new uh, plant from. And basically um, you find a nice um, long stem, uh, one what you're not gonna miss. And according to the thickness of the of this stem you choose different sizes of these globes you've got big ones you've got medium ones and you've got oh, you've got tiny ones and what you do folks you, you uh on the tiny ones they actually open up like they've got like a little hinge uh, but, but obviously they're not going to last forever um, but normally on the bigger ones you put uh, one of those plastic um, pull tie things around it but anyway basically what happens is on one of these twigs what you found these branches where you want a new plant from for instance an apple tree and you've got a nice a shoot you want to form a new apple tree from that uh, one what you got for instance I've got Braeburn so if I wanted a new a new Braeburn apple tree what I do is I find a suitable branch which is, you know, probably about this size, I suppose equivalent to a two-year sapling, I suppose. And um, what you do is you put a bit of um, um, moss peat into, I think I've got that right folks, I've forgotten the name, I've, I've left it down here, down in the bag in the other tunnel, but um, I think it's moss peat. It. yeah um, you put some of that into it no let's start again folks I'm confused I'm getting confused you scrape all the way around the twig you get a little bit of this rooting hormone rooting powder and you rub it around so literally you put your finger in just rub it a bit around then you get this and you fill it up with some of that moss peat uh, uh, compost thing and then you, 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 you've got these cutouts just here. So you go like that. The branch sticks through. I don't know whether you can see it. Sticks through these spaces here. Um, and then basically um, you, you make sure obviously it's wet, damp. You make sure that this stays closed. And after about eight weeks, you'll get it will root and you've got yourself a new plant. Then what you do is you cut it off underneath, not above, underneath, um, and then your roots are at the bottom in this in this thing. You open it out, and then you plant it in your pot and grow it on so it's bigger. And they are, and that's it. What I'm going to do is um, I will give some demonstrations throughout this year. I'm going to be doing about uh, over 50 of these. The plan is. Uh, I've uh, from various sizes, from, from apple trees to um, um, fruit bushes, um, maybe camellia, um, all different things what I can find around my allotment and at home 
and elsewhere people will allow me to uh, try out these and uh, and that's it folks um, I'm now going to uh, have a go at putting one of these on, on a suitable branch so I'm going to have a walk away, walk around see what I can find see what size one of these I need and uh, and I'll film that okay okay folks God, I've just had some technical difficulty. It appears that my, um, I don't, can you see me there? I know. It appears that my camcorder has altered um, its settings on screen. There you are, I can just see myself. Right folks, I'm on my Braben Apple and what I'm going to do, I'm going to, I'm just scraping all the way around. I found a su suitable branch here which is in the way and uh, so I'm just going to scrape all the way around Okay, okay folks, I know you can't see my face, but basically I've gone all the way around and took off about uh, a centimetre. I'm hoping that's going to be enough. And I've got me, um, my hormone rooting powder here. And all we do is just rub a bit around. All the way around, the bit where you scraped it off. You fill up your globe, folks, with some of this uh, moss uh, um, peat thing, multi compost stuff, and um, I'm going to do both halves. I've done one half, okay, folks. So, as you can see, I've filled it up with some uh, compost, uh, some of this moss stuff, and I've also given it a good water. I'm just going to put a little bit more in. So I've topped it up. Now, what it's saying in the instructions is that the red part's got to be facing south. Um, so, as it just happens that south is is over that direction. Um, so, if I put uh, that part on here, I, don't, I hope you can see that all right. So, there, there goes the branch. We're going to now. That's it, folks. Let's just make sure I've got this in the right place. Just there, there we are. And that should be it. Now, what I'm probably going to do, because it's probably fractionally um, on the loose side, I'm going to make sure it can't move, because we want it, it's going to stay on for eight weeks. So I'm just thinking, what I'm probably going to do is put a, a couple of little uh, clips just on either side just to hold it in place and stop it from moving or might maybe just a little bit of tape and uh, and we're going to come back in eight weeks how exciting eh right then so that's it folks that is it let's just show you we'll zoom in so you can just see so that's all on the on the branch I'm sorry about um, the quality, it's not, not the best of videos this one, um, 
But as I say, I'm going to be doing over 50 of these this year, and uh, so uh, w the sun is really bright today, which is playing havoc on my screen and on my eyes. But I think you can see there, you can get the idea that everything's in there. Uh, it's facing south, the red part, and, um, and now it's just a matter of uh, waiting. And uh, hopefully within um, eight weeks, you'll see a load of roots on that clear side on the left, which will tell us that um, it's been a success. And we're going to have a, a new tree, which is probably um, at about a two year, two year growth, I would say, two year old tree. Okay, thanks for watching.